What's up everyone and welcome back to Imagination Tech and this time I am announcing that we are once again going to be having another long range distance challenge contest happening over at the Mountain Servers PH Facebook group. Now this is going to be open for Philippine residents lang so uh na ako because uh our audience naman is so audience naman natin is going to be mga Filipinos lang muna for this contest. So basically uh, we want to see who can fly the farthest using their drones and using their fixed wing. Last time, uh, that was way back August 2021, uh, may mga nagtanong kung pwede bang gumamit ng fixed wing and the answer was yes. Pero this time, we're going to be separating it into its own category. So pwede, kang, pwede mag join ang mga fixed wing flyers and uh, iba kasi ang performance ng fixed wing. Eh. So pwede kaya kaya lang mag go ng medyo malayo. And they have the potential to out uh, outlast the mga drones natin. So we're going to be having a separate category for drones and a separate category for fixed wing. Now, last time we did a three-kilometer challenge where we asked everyone to send to upload their clips where they fly at least three kilometers, and we're going to award the longest and this the, the longest distance. This time, parang uh, we're going to do an open category. So. Uh, doesn't matter how far you go. Um, so, kung, kung ang pinakatap ngayon is just two kilometers, yun ay long distance, which really it's not. Pero kung, kung yun ang pinaka uh, highest, uh, longest distance na nagawa ng mga submissions this year, now we're going to qualify that as well. Personally, I think kaya natin mag challenge ng five kilometers, maybe seven kilometers, kaya ng ten kilometers. Eh. Especially, there are a lot of uh, DJI flyers now, and it's also possible to include OSD on your DJI DVR. So that's a limitation na wala last year, but this year, there's a way you can have your Betaflight OSD on your DJI goggles, as well as overlay uh, yung DVR onto that video. So check down below, there's a link to how to do that. Uh, but yes, uh, DJI OSD is, uh, it's a, it's a go this time. So we're going to see sino ba ang mas mas you know mas uh, kalayo this time. Is it the analog flyers with their you know super powerful VTXs and their really high gain antennas or will it be our new DJI competitors using their digital quads which have really really good uh, video reception and video quality pero meron daw silang limitation hard hard limit ng 13 kilometers. So we'll see kung aabot pa tayo ng 13 kilometers. We'll see. But um, just as a guideline, please fly with a spotter para at least nakikita nila kung nasan yung quad mo at all times. Finally, there's going to be another category that's going to be the best mountain video, mountain surfer video. Uh, dito, you can just, you can edit, you can really put your music, you can put your own creative influence on that video. Uh, make it really nice edit, nice cut. So, pwede siyang uh, isang place lang na really, really epic. Pwede din siyang compilation of, of uh, places. So, bahala na kayo kung paano nyo i-edit yun. Basta, it's within the time limit. I think it's uh, under four, 4 minutes. So, check na lang sa link below for all of the the contest rules and description. We have a lot of prizes this time. I'm giving a Transtech Laser Light as well as a Glide Frame for one of for uh, the, the best uh, mountain servers video as well as the longest range drone video. And uh, Pinoy FPV is sponsoring the iFlight folding backpack for the fixed wing category. And we have a lot more prizes like uh, the Axis Flying T-shirt, the Gem Fan Drawstring Prop Bag also from uh, Pinoy FPV, Runcam Robin Micro CMOS FPV camera from Drone Hub PH, uh, drone straps for 5 inch and micro quads also from Drone Hub PH. We have 10 sets of props from Headmaster FPV. Two Kaiju Power GCs worth 500 each from Kaiju Power, and uh, we'll probably have some more depending on um, you know if, if some more sponsors uh, decide to give us some more prizes to give away. So if if ever you don't win one of the challenges, we're still going to be raffling off one of these prizes to everyone who enters. Um, so good luck with that. So let's go over how to join the challenges. So if you're joining the drone or fixed wing long range distance challenges. You first need to have OSD and re recording on your DVR. So with, it doesn't matter if you have an analog setup or a DJI setup. You have to have uh, the OSD distance to home, uh, which is the maximum distance that your quad has flown away from your takeoff position. No, this is not your total flight distance. Uh, second, you also have the you must have the OSD timer. Now, having the GPS position is optional. That would give us a way to you know double check. 
uh, the distance in case there is a dispute but uh, probably you don't really need to put the, the GPS as, uh, as long as uh, we can uh, we can see your OSD uh, about the distance and the timer then I think that would be good enough uh, you must take off and land at approximately the same place. It doesn't have to be exactly the same place. This isn't a landing challenge, but a long distance challenge. But just, you know, just just, just to make sure that you do go out and you do come back and you just land uh, your drone beside you or whatever. So that's good enough. One-way flights don't count, but uh, do post anyway. We would love to see how your final flight with that quad looks like. So in case of a tie in uh, distance, we would be taking the shorter flight time. Uh, as the winner. Now, uh, for the mount best mountain surfing video, uh, you need, need you don't need OSD or DVR. In fact, you need uh, your HD quality video to be uploaded. Um, epic lo locations are uh, are great. It can be a compilation vid, risky fall, risky trails, waterfalls, a wicked edit, and a sick soundtrack will help you win this category. And you need to keep your submissions three minutes or less. So we don't really need to be bored about a long video. Just make it a, a quick cut, uh, something that really would entertain us. So that would give you a hit on how to edit your video. Now the general me mechanics is you need to be a member of the Mountain Surfers PH group. You need to be following uh, my YouTube channel as well as Headmaster's uh, channel. And you also have to be following Pinoy FBV, Drone Hub PH, and Kaiju Power on Shopee. And you need to upload your video directly onto the Mountain Surfers PH group. If you are uploading as well on uh, YouTube or other social media channels, you can put a link in the comments or in the caption of your video, but the video itself needs to be uploaded straight into the Mountain Surfers PH group. Right? And then you have to have the hashtags 2022 Year End LR Challenge and uh, one of the one of three hashtags depending on which challenge you're submitting for so if you're challenge you're entering for the drone long range long range challenge you have to have the hashtag drone lr challenge as well for the best mountain surfing video you have to have a hashtag mountain surfing challenge all right you can post as many you can you can submit as many videos as you can so for example this weekend you were you were able to do five kilometers and then you try it again next weekend you, did six kilometers seven kilometers of course we're, we're going to take the longest distance that you did or the the best time that you did for that distance uh, so any any number of submissions you can upload as many as you want as many edits as you want for the best mountain surfing video uh, just don't forget the hashtags and but you can only win once per category so the deadline of submissions is on midnight December 30 11 59 p.m. actually and uh, we will be having a judging for the best mountain surfing video. Uh, we're still deciding on the judges, but maybe you can ask Headmaster, maybe Black Bug Digital. Uh, we're we're going to finalize that and uh, we're going to be announcing the judges soon. Before New Year, we can, we'll have uh, the, the winner for the long range distance challenge, both for the drone and the fixed wing. So at least you'll know if you won before New Year. And as a reminder, it is a requirement to fly with a spotter. Uh, we personally won't check it, but uh, please fly with a spotter uh, as part of uh, you know CAAP guidelines. And lastly, have fun. Don't take this so seriously. Uh, the point is to have fun and you know maybe win some prize along the way. If you don't win anything, as long as we're pushing people beyond their their limits, their boundaries, then I think that's a, that's a win for the whole group. And we're going to have a lot of things to watch uh, by the new year. As long as we push each other, it's going to elevate. The whole FPV community here in the Philippines. All right, so good luck to all of you, all of you challengers. Uh, I hope we get a lot of new faces this year. Uh, I hope I hope a lot of people join because we have we do have a lot of great prizes. All right, so I'm going to keep it at that. Uh, I have links in the video about uh, samples of uh, how to do the challenge, so do check that out. And as always, keep building and keep flying.